What's in the van, everybody? Uh, Carl Walkner here, unique video today. I just wanted to show you what's in my van. A lot of musicians tour around, have equipment in the back. I wanna show you what I have and what unique stuff I might carry around when I'm playing my house shows and uh, travel around everywhere. So as you can see, there's a lot of stuff in here. That's why vans are important to me. With my trolley, I got my PA system, golf clubs. Let's go piece by piece. All right, so this is obviously when it's just me, when I haven't got my family with my wife and kids and our dog. Uh, I take out all the seats in the back and first things first, we've got some golf shoes. Golf bag, very important. Very, very important on the road. <laughs> okay, two guitars. I always bring two guitars on the road, obviously for safety measures. Now, if you're not sure what guitars I play, check out my other videos. Um, I've got my rig run down and all my guitars, but these are both my uh, Maton EMD 6s. I love these mini guitars. They pack up into nothing and you can throw them around. They're robust, they sound amazing. I have two 12-inch speakers, two 10-inch speakers, and two 12-inch subs. Now these are the Yamaha DXR series, the DXS series. I absolutely love them. They're compact. It's a compact but very powerful little PA system. This will do anywhere up to a few hundred people. Packs a big punch and it fits perfectly in my little van here. So apart from my PA system, I have... My rack. So this is what I plug all of my equipment into. I've got my mixer, a little wireless stuff there and I've got a bunch of cables and bags down the bottom. Front seat, let me show you exactly how this works. So you just kind of sit here and you're like. Water bottle, coffee, beats and podcasts, golf hat right up here in this control section. Follow me back here. You left me in stitches and took all of my riches so vicious and bold. All right, come check this out. Worth its weight in gold. A good fridge trolley. I've got my signs on there. These are puncture-proof tires and they are golden, golden, golden. You never have to replace them after years. It's awesome. All right, I've got my two subs, speaker poles and microphone stands. Got my little merch case here. Always take merchandise on the road. I have my pedals, extra accessories and cases and stuff in there full of equipment. Uh, this is something that you don't expect that a lot of people should have. So I've got spare guitar strings, gaffer tape, soldering iron, <laughs> spare cables, a multimeter, electrical spray. This, uh, this keeps water out. This actually helps a lot of effects pedals. If, you, uh, if somebody spills a beer on it or something crazy, you wanna fix it real quick. A knife, little things in here, kind of like like a pair of pliers, you'd be surprised how often you just need to, you know, you might need to fix a microphone stand or you might need to, I don't know, sort out something on your guitar. All of these things are extremely important. When you're at home, you've got access to most of these things, but when you're on the road, sometimes you just need a screwdriver to tighten something up or whatever. So I have all of this stuff in here and highly, highly recommend it. Apparently it's rush hour for jet patrol today. Last but not least, let me get this sub out the way. Oh, there's a dog there. Hey. So we got, this is Sunday. Um, I try to smuggle her wherever I go. Don't I? Yes. I know it sounds strange, but a floor rug is actually really important to take on the road. You don't always pull it out, but it's one of those things that if you need it, you really need something to stand on. It could be a hard surface. The stage could be doing a funky thing or it just looks bad and you need to add some flavor. But I always throw a, a floor rug in. It kind of protects the car from equipment, wear and tear, and it looks super cool on the stage. So there you have it, you guys. That's what's in my van. Um, I hope that helps you. Let me know if there's any questions. Uh, throw them in the comments below. And if you want to see more of this sort of stuff, so hopefully I'll see you on the road. Peace out.